So uh, let's welcome into the ring in the red corner. It's Jory Sinenkov. His opponent in the blue corner is the one and only Simon Tokate! This will be a five two minute round for the light cruiserweight European title. Five two minute rounds for the light cruiserweight European title. Jury Shinenkov in the red corner and the hometown fighter Sammy Dotty in the blue corner. Sammy's fought in the past three. Uh, bad to the bones now. He's fighting a light cruiserweight tonight, but he gives over a stone in weight to his opponent here. Yeah, Yuri Zhrenkov doesn't look like he's tearing up for the fun and games. He's a much bigger man. Sam is going to have to use that, that ducking, bobbing and weaving that he was using last time against Holmes to close the distance and get on the inside. Power double <laughs> for the two. Two points in another sport, that one. Nice, nice jab. jab there by Simi. And a nice backhand as well, following up off it. Good work. Busier man of the two, isn't he, Simon? Here, yeah, definitely. He's pushing the pace, he's controlling the ring, he's doing everything he needs to do. And there's something to be said here for if you are Senenkov and you know that your opponent's given up over a stone and weight to you, should you be letting them push you back like this? No, not at all, not at all. But also, you know, the lighter guy's probably the faster, potentially got the more stamina. Do you just let him burn himself out? So they're equal on the takedowns now at this point. Two points each. Again, just entering in there off a nice jab is Simi. Big shots landed there by both men. Simon did well to slip those jabs and then answered back with a couple of shots, but then in that exchange, he took some shots himself. Ooh, shots landed after the belt. Yeah, that yeah. was yeah. one each there. So, yeah. Absolute warriors once is. again. <laughs> First round over.
Round two of five. First round quite clearly going to Simon Edge, the busier one of the two. Yeah, he held the ring position and he pushed the pace. He threw more shots. There's a lot of power behind those shots when Zdenkov stepping in like that. Yeah, I think Simon's just determined not to be pushed around by the larger guy at the moment. Yeah, and he, you know, he, he's not there a lot of the time when Zdenkov's throwing these shots. No, you can't Lovely have a match his last fight if he was doing something like ducking under, stepping off to the right hand side like he was. Counting with that uh, right hook, how exactly how he's going at home, if he was to step, bring that into this game now. I think maybe some clean shots for him. Big deep breaths being taken by Stanenkov here. There's a lot of muscle being carried by that man. Yeah, which, you know, ultimately muscle is, you know, it requires cardio and, you know, you drain your cardio quicker than a guy with, with less muscle. You can see now Simon slipping back into that duck under. And he landed a nice left up there, Simon. That jab looks like it's going to get a swell into the eyes. Big yeah, overhand right there. Very ugly fight in those moments. It is. Simon looks a lot better when he's allowing himself to work off that jab, you know. He's working at range, but then with the, the way Senenkov is allowing himself to be pushed back, naturally the fight is just taking place against the ropes. The referee got a bit of a headbutt there. Yeah, you can't help but think Sam is getting the better of the exchange in the open, but he chooses to close the distance yeah. and, 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 and crowd his own work. Yeah, which is something we've commented about you yeah, know, in, in the previous just like, fight. I always feel like he needs to believe in himself a little bit more to just allow himself to hang back away from the ropes. And Another great shot. round once again. Let's Same get man, behind you know, them, come on. Let's I guess the problem being against the is how he does have success in those clinches with a bit of the dirty boxing, so 100%. Three or five here. Big, big deep breaths being taken by Senenkov. I don't know if I'm reading into it, but the way the lads just embrace there, the way Senenkov, you know, kind of... Do you think it's the final round? I think he thinks it's a three-round fight. Good work by both lads here in the clinch. Might be a blessing in disguise here in the third round if he thinks it, it is uh, the final round. He might let his hands go with a bit, of, a bit of urgency, which you know he hasn't been doing. Definitely, he could have a, bit, a little bit of venom behind him, a little bit of extra. I think Simon's hurt his hand here as he walked away from that exchange there. He squeezed his hand, took a little look at it. Just those P's and Q's of basic boxing that's setting them apart here. You know, there's no head movement from Senenkov at all. And Simon isn't there to be hit when Senenkov's trying to, to land on him. <laughs> nice combination there. Job there, triple jab, nice lines, yeah. clean. And for the two again on the double. Full 
for the amount of jabs that Sami's managed to land here on Sinenkov and the shots that Sinenkov is taking straight to his face. He's not wearing it on his face much for bare knuckle, is he? No, not at all. He's there's not much swelling. Definitely thick skin. Yeah, there's not much swelling. He's not, he's not got a cut. He's just hitting thin air there, though. Another great round as we go on to the next one. One more push. From Round four or five, this is your penultimate round. One more push, come on, let's get behind For the light cruiserweight European title. <laughs> and so far, I think it's clear to say Simon's three rounds up, so Sinenkov now, you know, at this point in the fight, we'll have to get a stoppage, I believe, for him yeah, to win this. Yeah, he's boxing a smart fight, Simon is. He's taking his time, he's picking the shots, he's just outscoring his opponent. Cheeky little uh, lick out of the tongue there. Yeah, Sinenko just hitting thin air there in that corner. I think I'm going to say the problem here is that I think Simon's happy to see out the distance in the decision. Whereas his opponent is looking for the stoppage. And there's always that one shot chance. What's going on? He's Sinenko saying he can't continue, he's hurt his leg, but I mean. That leg injury just so happened to have occurred when he threw about 15 unanswered shots and Simon stuck his tongue out at him. Uh, I, I don't think he's feeling it at the minute. They carry on, but I, I, that's a telltale sign to me of someone who's just lost all motivation. For the way out, I don't yeah. But like, like I've, just, uh, I've just said there, he's looking for that one point yeah, shot. There we go, it's all over in the last round. You know, I'm no expert, but I'd bet me bottom dollar that there's absolutely nothing up with his leg, and he, he was just outclassed there and he didn't want it. Fair play to Sammy Doherty. That's another win in the books for him.
Simon, absolute pleasure once again, mate. Uh, you're a great guy. You show so much respect for people. You're a good person in general. You're looking in the best shape I've seen you for a long time. Did you feel you were always in control tonight? Yeah, I felt in control. I didn't feel any minute like that. I was in there, uh, that I was in any danger. But with this sport, it just takes one punch to end it all. But I want to say thank you to Steph, Baz, my brother, and Mark. Put the camera on Mark over there, look. He's done a great job, he's done me corner. Steph Tommy Corner, as my mother, thank you to everybody for coming. Now, I'm gonna go get some beer, chat some women up, see you later. Simon Doxy, always there to entertain, fair play, good luck.